You too, welcome back. I've got some new frags. This is Oa. It's just really cool. So the light is in the is pretty attentic right now, so it's not really in daylight. And that really won't make it colors pop. So I'm trying my best, but um the Zoas, let's start on the Zoas from the bottom left corner. You can't really tell what they're I'm looking to the side because I can't tell through the camera. So they are red with an orange center, <clears throat> blue next to the center, and then red uh, tentacles. And there's one, two, there's three of those, four of those that you can see. Let's see if I get back. Okay. Then next to those, there's some blue ones with orange centers and orange tentacles on the outside. As you can see, some really small ones too. Then the larger ones kind of in the center are yellow with red next to the yellow, blue, and then orange in the center. And then the really two, the two large ones, that's, that's those. The ones just left of that and up a little bit that one is bright pink with yellow tentacles and like a red in between them. And then the ones, if you keep going up the screen a little bit, those ones are yellow, red, yellow, which is kind of crazy. And they're really small, so it's hard to tell. I don't know what they'll, they'll um, grow out to look like. And then uh, the, some of the small ones on the right that aren't open, they are open up uh, two days ago when I first, well, at the fish store they were open. So I got them a couple of days ago. Uh, those were a couple of green ones right there. Kind of like my other colony. And uh, so this is really cool. So I mean, I've got like five different kinds of zoas on this one little frag and it was 15 bucks. Really cool. Really excited about that one. So let's move on. Here's my, uh, I just want to show you my older one. Let me zoom out slightly. Not even close, there we go. Okay, it's top down again. So they're doing really well. They're coloring up pretty good, and as you can see, they've left the frag. There's one, two, three. There's seven that's off the frag. So they're starting to grow. The reason why they were closed up before, if you watch my other older videos, and they're really, um, <clears throat> they were really um, extended, is because of the light. I only had my light at 40%, thinking that was enough. I don't have a par meter or anything. And I was moving them around the tank and stuff, but just wherever I put them, it still wasn't bright enough. And I was messing with, you know, different spots for flow and whatnot, but I found what it was. It was the light that was irritating them. So now they're, they're starting to take off again, which is, I'm really happy. I also got a green candy cane. So it's got four heads. Uh, two of them are trying to completely separate, which is really good. Really cool. And let me show you my GSP. This frag was 15. So this one and the Zoa were both 15, and the candy cane was 20. So I did it pretty good for 50 bucks. And let me do a side shot of these Zoas. Because I love Zoas. It is so cool. This is going to be a definitely a Zoa dominated tank. Just a lot of softies in this one. I might get some hard corals, but kind of like soft corals. There's another this side of it. As you can see there's some new new rizoas growing right there too. And uh, the coralline you can kind of tell where it's at with this kind of lighting. It's on the top of that rock where that, where that frag's at. Left corner right there. 
a big spot of the coralline. But anyways, that was my last video. I'm on to new stuff. Father's Day, I'm getting a present. My wife said no fish. They keep dying. She's not too sure I can keep corals alive, so she's getting me a wave, a wave uh, pump, wave maker. All right, so that'll be on Father's Day. Maybe I'll get it before and I'll post another video. All right, you guys take care.